And welcome to the eastern part of England. We find ourselves at Carrow Road. My name is Derek Ray. Excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Carabao Cup. It's Norwich City, and they take on Gillingham. Well, the hosts certainly go into this game as strong favourites. They have better technical players and can be brilliant when everything clicks. But their opponents are well organised, resilient and pose a threat on the counter-attack. Therefore, an early goal will be the main priority for the home team. And here's the Norwich City starting 11. Well, it's regarded as a negative shape. But if they control the middle of the park, play some expansive football, the wide players can then come in field to join the centre forward and the fullbacks can push on. Let's hope they do that today. And introducing the visitors lineup today. Well, if the players at the side of the diamond don't tuck in when they lose possession and the number 10 doesn't recover, the holding midfield player could be in for a really difficult game today. And they kick off here. Well, as the replay shows us, this is the way to beat tight marking. Just look how he turns with the ball. That's a fantastic goal, you have to say. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Well, they keep passing away. Dempsey. Reeves. Can they convert? Denied by the bar. Back in play here. Well, had that gone in, they would be in complete control of this game. As it is, they're still going to be a bit nervy. Real chance. And tonight again. Mali prevented it from going over the line. Todd Cantwell. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Cantwell. Has a go. Superb block. Oh, he's through here. Well, in the end, it was rather straightforward for the goalkeeper, Stuart. Well, he has to do better there. That's a really poor finish. An alert intervention. Cantwell. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Oliver. Les Melou. Yanoulis. Lucas Rupp. Running with the ball confidently. And a goal kick given. Ryan Jackson. 
Oliver. Lloyd. Well, knocked on the target. The keeper seemed to have it covered. Well, he did seem to have it covered, but it's not a bad effort, though. He really did strike it well. Cantwell. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But really sticking to the task defensively. Possession given away, unfortunately. And the flag does go up. Must have been tight. They're really pressing their opponents. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. And it's a quality pass. And a no-nonsense clearance. Todd Cantwell. Les Melou. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Decent progress with the ball at his feet. Great strong tackle. Throw in forthcoming. And pull back. Well, tremendous block. Tremendous ball played through. Well, now in a dangerous position. The net is steering him in the face. In it goes. But it will not stand offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. Ball's gone. Options in the middle. It's got to be. And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender's just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, as you can see, he doesn't mess about here, does he? He's strong, well-balanced and skillful. That's a top-class finish. So, 2-0 now. Cantwell. Well, high marks for that pass. Now, let's see what they can do here. Yanulis. Well, no stopping him. Poor pass. There's a slide draw pass. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Well, they haven't seen too many chances, but the crowd sensing this could be a turning point. They need a goal here. This looks promising. In position. Really vital interception. Will he finish? <laughs> Terrific block there. Ball is loose. Cleared away. And good pressure high up the pitch. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. And so it is. The first half story has been written. Well, he hasn't quite had... The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Norman. Cantwell. A 
An awful lot of green space to run into. That's a nice looking ball. But it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Todd Cantwell. And the ball with Roop for attacking possibilities. But ultimately up a cul-de-sac. Excellent vision. Offside it is, but he needed sharp eyes to make that decision. Well, it's fine margins, isn't it? But in the end, he just went too early. Cantwell. As you can see, the visitors have had much less of the ball, but they've certainly shown an ability to counter-attack when they win it back. I expect more of the same. I think it's been a really good performance from them so far. Well, he needs to be careful here. Mackenzie. Intercepting it intelligently. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Ozan Kabak. Lukas Rup. Well, potential danger. The inside route looks promising. Shot attempted. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Well, I still can't believe that didn't go in, Derek. It's a fantastic stop from the keeper, you have to say. Oh, Stewart's a chance! Oh, a disappointing shot, all things considered. Well wide in the end. Time for a change, then. Dempsey. Lee. Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. Rashica. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Les Menu. Can the owner of the green convertible car, the green convertible car, pardon me, reception, please return to your vehicle immediately? Thank you. High quality defending. Superbly. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, sloppy in possession. Effective looking pass. And beyond the last defender, offside. Well, they have been getting three substitutes warmed up. And by the look of it, all three are coming on. Not what he was intending. Bad pass. Can they create something from here? And disappointing that it's gone out of play. And a substitution in the offing. Number seven, Lucas Rook. To be replaced by number 23, Kenny McLean. McLean. So on the cusp of the final whistle, and the visitors very much in command, Stuart. Yeah, this has been a good performance. They've looked really sharp going forward and they've shown a lot of energy. They'll certainly be pleased with their overall display up to now. McLean. Now with Limelou. They've regained possession. Could reduce the deficit. Still could be dangerous. Defensive excellence there.
And he did well to cut it out. Well, they might be onto something. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. And they're making a change. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Not the best clearance. McLean. And he's won the ball. An incisive pass. Keeper getting the touch. And a goal to tighten things up. They've thrown themselves a lifeline. So back underway at 2-1. Tight contest here. Max Ema. Really well played pass. Well, possibilities in the centre. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. So two minutes to be added on at the end. Well, the fans are certainly playing their part here. Just listen to this noise. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. There's the final whistle, and the visitors move on. Well, they certainly weren't fancied coming into this game, but what a good performance that was. Great organisation, tremendous energy, and a fair amount of quality as well. It really was a wonderful display. I think it's accurate to say, Stuart, that this man was the light bringer for his side. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was. There it is, and just the ideal start.